Greenbrew underscore YT and welcome back to my YouTube channel and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys the process of my closet renovation that I did it's quite it's not that like major but I've had this closet for about six years and what it just has is a plank on the top and a rod like closet rod across the center of it um, and for me, I wanted something that was a little bit more accessible for my accessories and I wouldn't have everything laying out in the open. Like for example, I have like bags um, and like hair clips, claw clips, and I want to put them in their own spot. So we went to three stores before we ended up finding where, which path to go. Target, there was a bookshelf and I was just going to take the shelves out. Um, Lowe's was like kind of like making it solve using wood pieces putting them together assembling but it's kind of like a lot of work and would cost a little more and the last place we went was um ikea and ikea there was a particular shelf billy when i went there last time it was out of stock so i had to go back and get it and then we took a little pass to the rooms because they're so cool i love them um and i wish i could stay in ikea if all those things actually worked but look look at this it's so pretty and um we had to get back to it because it was getting late so we went to uh, not the pickup but where you get like the individual pieces and stuff um i don't know what you call this but we went there we got a cart and um picked up Billy
we took off. You can call these like, what would you call these? Like, um, what do you call these? Um, like a back support. I can't think of a name right now, but like the back support for shelving. Um, bracket, the bracket. So we took off the bracket, so we have leftover marks. And even if you look at this, this needs to be painted and everything. And the whole uh, closet, I think we're gonna paint like a color, probably white, because if I show you, so if you close the closet, you have still this much space that is still like, showing so we can't really change the color of this so let me show you guys the cubes a little bit and like what i'm thinking about doing in them so i gave this one to all of my sweatshirts so they are from black to white there's like blue and grays in there so i kind of left this like this because winter when winter comes um i can either take this out or i can um like take them from here i think um when you have a lot of like big thick like sweatshirts here it gets a little stuffy and the second one i have like green to browns like all of my sweatshirts um and then in this one i added this light in here i'll put the link for this in the description i'm thinking about keeping a little bit of like jewelry and stuff in here I'll, like some things that stand out a bit this one i'm like completely clueless i'm thinking like storage maybe i don't have any clothes in here maybe or like i have like a bunch of hair accessory on my desk which needs a place so i think this might be like the perfect spot and then i got this i will put a link for this if i can find one if not it's just a regular sage green um storage bin and in here i have like a bunch of shirts and it's not organized in here the bottom section um sorry i had to turn the flashlight on it's really dark in my closet um these are like sweaters so there's like different type of sweaters and then there's like these two um like jackets here next purchase i kind of made for this um closet makeover was this purse hanger um so instead of hanging your purse on like a like a regular hanger this is just made for a purse so we're gonna try this out i got a pack of 10 which for like a first try should have gotten like a five pack but i think it will come out handy this is my innovation or creation whatever you want to call it it's replaceable so you don't have to worry and you're not doing any major like thing in the wall like trying to like make a hole and hook something up you can obviously put like a rod like this in a smaller size between here but i just wanted to make it super affordable and just something quick that, that i can put in there and if i don't want it i can take it out so um you can get this dowel thing from walmart in the arts and crafts section they have different um thickness of this so you can get that from there um this is just from a plastic water bottle and then this is just double-sided tape so this is the tape i used for this and i just kind of like taped the edge of it and then glued it there and you can move this up and down or side to side if you would like so this is the creation and let me show you guys now i do get that there's clothes behind it so how are you going to put something on here in the bag i was going to stick in there i'm going to try that out and then i'll come back to you okay so i put these on here and it's actually not bad like compared to like if i would have hung them on here they would have been so annoying let me be real because it would just come in your face like you know like i want the space to be empty so, so if i would have put it up here it would have just been super annoying so i think over here 
and you can just push them to one side so it should not be a problem and now with this like how am i gonna reach for my pants i have that same exact question so we're gonna see how it how i can do it what if i put my pants on here too no i'm gonna put my pants back so i was experimenting so i think before it was like right over here and now i push it all the way to the top I'm trying to see if I would make this better because then I can still take off my clothes without like you know having to take it under and over so I think I I like this better and then also all the backs kind of go to the back and by the way this looks like weird on here it looks white on here but on this it looks gray so this is kind of how it's looking um it does kind of get in that way but as I said oh 